Our jobs are fleeing the country. They're going to Mexico. They're going to many other countries. You look at what China is doing to our country in terms of making our product. They're devaluing their currency, and there's nobody in our government to fight them. And we have a very good fight, and we have a winning fight, because they're using our country as a piggy bank to rebuild China. And many other countries are doing the same thing. It's our country's in deep trouble. We don't know what we're doing when it comes to devaluations and all of these countries all over the world, especially China, they're the, the best, the best ever at it. What they're doing to us is a very, very sad thing. So because we will be making investments where we can grow the economy. Take clean energy. Some country is going to be the clean energy superpower of the 21st century. Donald thinks that climate change is a hoax perpetrated by the Chinese. I think it's real. I, I did I think not. Science I did not. is real. I do not say that. And well, when I, I was Secretary of State, we actually increased American exports globally 30 percent. We increased them to China 50 percent. Our, so our airports are like from a third world country. You land at LaGuardia, you land at Kennedy, you land at LAX, you land at Newark. And you come in from Dubai and Qatar, and you see these incredible, you come in from China, you see these incredible airports, and you land, we become a third world country. So We need to make it very clear, whether it's Russia, China, Iran, or anybody else, the United States has much greater capacity. And we are not going to sit idly by and permit state actors to go after our information our private sector information or our public sector information. I don't think anybody knows it was Russia that broke into the DNC. She's saying Russia, 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 but I don't, maybe it was. I mean, it could be Russia, but it could also be China. It could also be lots of other people. It also could be somebody sitting on their bed that weighs 400 pounds, okay? Because you look at some of these countries, you look at North Korea, uh, we're doing nothing there. China should solve that problem for us. China should go into North Korea. China is, is totally, powerful as it relates to North Korea.